somba note the family of the slain Menengai Oilers rugby player Anthony Kibet is now calling for speedy investigations into his death that occurred on Saturday last weekend. Since his demise, Menengai Oilers has suspended training in order to give their former teammate a deserving send-off. Ruth Sarmue tells us more, even as investigations continue to apprehend the perpetrators. The family of the 24-year-old Anthony Kibet is yet to come to terms with his sudden demise. Kibet was stabbed on his way home in the company of a fellow player and two other women when they were accosted by a known man on a motorcycle. And the wife and the wife were scared and they were immediately. They were immediately and Kibet was killed. Since the inception of Menengai Oilers in 2016, Kibet has been remembered as a great rugby player who played position center 13 and 12. Rugby alianza akiwa primary. Nyanya alichukuliwa alikuwa anatusaidia juu unaona at least alikuwa anapata kitu. Kibet is a champion. Tumecheza na Sevens yote. Tume win Prince Lu Sevens, tume win series, tukipushiana. Lakini niambie this round ya alikuwa na plan to make Kenya Sevens. His demise has dealt a major blow not only to his family but also his team who are still trying to come to terms with the shocking death. So alikuwa kuje hiyo weekend. Ovisa unaona hiyo weekend tulikuwa tunamngoja hata ajaye tuambia kuna mtu amemthreaten jua hata by the way akuwagi mchopozi hata ukiuliza mtu ana maneno from the friend uh, who is also a teammate was in the hospital uh, he was stabbed uh, in the lower abdomen on the left side that uh, there are some few stabs on the chest at the moment we are informed is in a stable condition so and while the police are still conducting their investigations the family is calling for justice <laughs> ni watu angalilie au vijana wenye walimuoa juu tunasikia ni vijana wa confirm Kibet will be buried this Friday in Nakuru Ruth Sarmoi and TV